Ask Reddit by Josh Hagan6. You just won a billion dollars, what are you still not buying? Snapchat Plus There's a plus version some people willingly pay for. Raid Shadow Legends It's free and I still refuse to get anywhere near that shit. Math. No you can afford coke now. That I have just won a billion dollars. It would take me weeks after the money is in my account to truly accept it and start spending it. $1000 steaks covered in gold leaf. Any food involving gold leaf. It's so stupid. Reddit premium. There's premium? Salt buys BS. I wouldn't let that dude pay me to make me food. Heroin. If you become famous they just give it to you. TikToker merchandise. Extended warranty for my car. I bought my truck used. Came with the gold whatever extended warranty. Had to fight the assholes to honor it despite it being in the purchase conditions. Cost the previous owner 5k, me nothing. I got 5k out of it easy. Worth every penny I never spent. Expensive foods with edible gold. My ex is bullshit. A blue check mark. OP never mentioned a trillion dollar. Any MLM product. New husband. This is the last answer I expected. Good for you and your successful marriage. NFTs. No no no. You're supposed to sell the NFTs. That's where the money is. A mega yacht. Seems like all the uberich folks feel the need to buy one. Just a big, stupidly expensive. Constantly in need of work and maintenance, money pit. Status symbols are dumb. I appreciate you recognizing that maintenance and upkeep costs are the biggest cost of owning a large boat like that. As a private jet mechanic, I would say that whatever you buy the jet for, you will pay in maintenance and operating costs in the first two years. That said, my answer is a private jet. That Epstein killed himself. I chuckled. Another house in a hoa. Just buy all the houses in the hoa and disband the damn thing. Somebody's love. Expensive designer brand clothes. I'd pay extra for good quality, materials, and features, but never just for a label. Would hire a tailor and seamstress and have them make all my clothes. The farm. Gosh, that's exactly what I would be buying. Anything from the Kardashians. $20,000 handbags. Heck I wouldn't even buy a $1,000 handbag. What in the world is the point? I bought a $600 briefcase about 15 years ago so probably at least a grand in today money. It's a leather one from one of those brands that's all about they'll fight over it after you're dead and a 100 year warranty, it's been my EDC ever since. It's been on 3 continents and probably 30 states. Hundreds of flights, thousands of trips on public transportation, more hotel rooms and conference rooms than I could count. It has developed a little bit of a patina but otherwise it's still exactly like the day I bought it. Which is a lot to say, a really high quality bag might be expensive up front, but if it looks fantastic you can use it forever. I used to wear out a $150 bag every year or so, I'm not easy on them and I need something that looks professional. This thing has saved me so much money by now. Any kind of fears for my body no matter what I have insecurities about in life. It's funny because the first serious thing I'd get after the initial bullshit binge is upgrade my joints and bones. Twitter. How about Reddit? 
one of those Dumbasape NFTs. Reddit Awards You just forced the Redditors to bury you alive in awards. Farts in a jar. What about bath water from an OnlyFans model? Any of your bullshit, I just checked my account.